Understanding Back Sweetening, a guide for English language learners. Hello and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore an interesting phrase, back sweetening. This term is often used in food processing and music production, but it has a broader application in everyday English as well. Let's dive in and understand what it means and how you can use it in your conversations. Back sweetening originally comes from the world of food processing, particularly in making beverages like cider or wine. It refers to the process of adding sugar or sweeteners to a product after it has been processed to enhance its sweetness. This technique is used to balance flavors, especially after fermentation, which can reduce the natural sweetness of the product. In music production, back sweetening takes on a slightly different meaning. Here, it involves adding audio effects or additional tracks to a recording after the initial mix is done. This could be to enhance the sound, add depth, or balance out different elements in the track. It's a form of post-production refinement to make the music sound better. Beyond its technical uses, back sweetening is also used metaphorically in everyday English. It describes the act of improving or enhancing something after its initial completion. For example, if you finish a report but then go back to add some final touches to make it better, you're back sweetening your report. Now, let's look at how to use this phrase in a sentence. After tasting the homemade wine, he decided it needed back sweetening. The final mix of the song was good, but it needed some back sweetening to really shine. I thought my presentation was done, but a little back sweetening with additional facts made it much more effective. Back sweetening is a versatile phrase that can be used in various contexts, from food and music to everyday tasks. It's all about adding that extra bit of sweetness or improvement to something already made. We hope this video has helped you understand and use back sweetening in your English conversations. Happy learning and see you in our next video.